all important sprint towards turn one. Welcome to another Formula One Grand Prix. The 3.6 mile long Silverstone circuit is one of the longest of the season with 18 corners in the current layout. With average lap speeds reaching around 145 miles per hour, it's also one of the quickest tracks of the year. Watch out for cars taking the right-handers of Abbey and Cops flat out. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today, it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of turn one. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? There are three main things to worry about there, Crofty. Positioning, awareness and discipline. First, you have to put your car in a bit of space and make sure you have room to react to what the others are doing. Then you have to watch your mirrors and listen to the sounds around you to get a sense of where everyone is. And finally, just don't get too greedy. Just because a gap exists doesn't always mean you should go for it. With the race minutes away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. Good job yesterday from Valtteri Bottas. The fin starts from pole position and Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Perez, Daniel Ricciardo and Sainz, Gasly, Stroll, Ocon and Charles Leclerc, Norris, Fernando Alonso, Yuki Tsunoda and Vettel, Raikkonen, Russell, Antonio Giovinazzi and Mick Schumacher, Latifi and Nikita Mazepin. And now it's time to head down to the track. Okay, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down.
Now use DRS. DRS now available. Race over, take care of the car on the way in. Plenty of action here at Silverstone. It was a memorable race, and what an impressive victory. Anthony, tell me, what was it that helped them achieve this success? Well, I honestly feel it was down to the driver and car today. I mean, we can talk driver skill all day, but if you don't have a solid team to back that, you're never going to get anywhere. When you hit that sweet spot of having both an excellent driver and an incredible car, that's when you see results like those we witnessed today. After an excellent performance at the Grand Prix, I'm sure there'll be plenty of celebrations tonight amongst the Mercedes team, and they certainly deserve it. Some amazing talent out on the track today. But Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? It's got to be Lewis Hamilton. I mean, he pulled off some impressive feats out on the track today, even by his standards. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. <laughs>